How's it going guys, Zabby here, and today we're going to be going to Alberta to catch the Voodoo Fish. Now for this setup guys, you're going to need to catch some shells, put them in your backpack. So make sure you have enough inventory space in your backpack. Also, you're going to need some sort of lure setup just so that way you can grab the shells. And then what I'm going to be using is some bottom rods and some float rods. Make sure to bring a float rod uh, just to get the one part done because it will say... Equip it to uh, a telescopic or float rod, but either way you can use bottom rods I'm just gonna bring one float rod just in case there is the depth I will throw the conversion up for you guys on the screen However, we need to go there. We need to get these shells So I'm gonna show you guys exactly how to do that So what we're gonna do guys head on over to Alberta buy an advanced license and let's go to Canada All right guys cast out in this general direction here Go to one speed or whatever's going to keep your lure on the bottom. Let it drift all the way down to the bottom. And then all you're going to do is pull it a along the uh, the floor of the lake here. And you will get shells. And once you see a snag pop up, uh, you can reel in faster. So just do it and just keep reeling in. You see we got snag there. So now reel in super fast. And now we should have our third shell here. And you're just going to do that, guys, until you have five shells and have the uh the bait for the uh voodoo fish you can see here we're at already at number three so just keep doing that guys and eventually you will get them all all right guys there is the final shell we're gonna go ahead and get the first part of it done we got the voodoo shells now so let's go on equip the mission again there we go so now it's gonna say equip voodoo shells to telescopic or match rod we're gonna be using um bottom rods as well so I'm using 4-0 or 6-0 hooks here, guys. Uh, so let's throw voodoo shells on there. Voodoo shells on there. Voodoo shells on there. And voodoo shells on there. Again, guys, 150 centimeters. I'll throw the conversion up for you guys using 6-0 hooks on every single one of these. So let's uh, head to nighttime. We're going to go to the night peak. So we're going to go to about 2,300 hours here. Uh, we're going to put down our rod stand once we get there. And we are going to just cast out in pretty much the same direction we just were fishing in. So let's go with um, all of these. Let's do one there. And we'll do another one in that area here. And we'll do it a little bit further back with this one. And we're just gonna cast in that general area guys you don't have to follow it exactly but basically anywhere in this area you're gonna be able to catch these bad boys so let's throw the last bottom rod there and then i'll grab the float rod and we'll use that looks like we already got a fish on which is surprising i'm just gonna go ahead and cast this real quick If we do have the monster on already, that would be really, really quick. All right, let's see what we got. Oh, bait was eating or lost, so that sucks. All right, guys, we got a fish on. Hopefully, it is one of the voodoo fish. That would be nice. Get it done very, very quick. Just so you guys understand, like, it's only 2306, so I basically just went here, just threw my lines in the water, and already got a fish on. And it's going to be a little bit of a pain with this rod. This bottom sniper it's a little bit underpowered this is the very first bottom sniper you get so it only goes up to like 14 kilograms and i think i'm using 11 kilogram line so this is going to be a hell of a battle here guys i'm going to up the drag a little bit but we're going to get very very good xp for this and also one thing i want to let you guys know is i stream this game over on twitch almost every single day so come stop by my twitch link is down in the description below another thing is if you do happen to get another bite well you have the fish on like i do right now you can actually pull out more than one of these fish and you can do that for some of the other monsters too now it is kind of it does take some luck and stuff like that but when i first did this on my main account i actually pulled out two of them which was kind of cool uh don't expect it to happen but if you guys do get another bite then it's probably another monster on so just so you guys know you can grab two here this is gonna be a hell of a fight oh there we go now we're winning. Let him run. 
39 meters, not bad. See, like we got another one on. That fish takes there. I'm gonna set the hook and put this one down to be honest with you. Come on. Really heavy fish. You can just tell it's completely dead weight. It's just like a big lake trout. Just completely dead weight. They run on you a little bit and then they get tuckered out and they just they're just completely dead weight. It looks like we're gonna get this bad boy in. See if he goes for one last run here. Come on. And there we go, guys. There is the White Moose Voodoo Fish Monster. Super, super easy to catch, guys. It takes like five minutes. It really doesn't take long at all. There we go, boys. There's the Voodoo Fish. I will catch you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching, everyone. There we go, guys. We actually ended up catching two. So there you go. There's proof that it does work. You got two of the Voodoo Fish. Thanks for watching, everyone. If you like the video, make sure to hit that like button and that subscribe button. Ring the bell so you don't miss a single video. Check out the description for links to my other social media platforms like Twitch, where I stream five days a week. Come hang out live. It's a lot of fun. Also, make sure to come type a comment. Tell me to catch more fish or whatever you guys want. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll catch you guys in the next one.